and we have a topic weight function here is the weight function in differential equations from the book of ordinary differential equation of Dennis Giesel a set of real value function phi naught of x phi 1 of x phi 2 of x up to so on is said to be orthogonal with respect to a weight function w of x on an interval a comma b if definite integral from a to b phi m of x phi n of x w of x dx is equal to 0 where m is not equal to n here is m is not equal to n the usual assumption is that w of x greater than 0 on the interval of orthogonality a comma b is interval the set 1 cos x cos 2x up to so on is orthogonal with respect to, to the wet function then w of x is equal to 1 on the interval negative pi gamma pi here is interval so this is the definition of weight function weight function is very important topic for engineering students and mathematics students or let's move on next page here's the next page the function the function phi naught of x is equal to 1 and phi 1 of x is equal to 2x comma phi 2 of x is equal to 4x square minus 1 comma f3 of x is equal to 8x cube minus 4x a4 of x is equal to 16x power 4 minus 12 x square plus 1 comma f5 of x is equal to 32x power 5 minus 32x plus 6x are pairwise orthogonal on the interval negative 1 comma 1 relative to the weight function w of x is equal to radical 1 minus x square they are known as example of Chebyshev polynomials of the second kinds so let's move next <coughs> some of the linear ordinary differential equations with their general solutions are as follows y prime plus y is equal to 0 alpha y is equal to alpha multiplied by y is equal to 0 its general solution is y is equal to c1 e power alpha negative alpha x okay then second derivative y double prime plus alpha square y is equal to 0 comma a greater than 0 its general solution is y is equal to c1 cos alpha x plus c2 sin alpha x then x y double prime plus y prime plus a alpha square x y is equal to 0 this equation its general solution is y is equal to c1 j naught alpha x plus c2 y naught alpha x okay next page next page it is the ends here our topic is considerable for the ending so today's lecture about weight function i hope you understand very well weight function and thank you for watching my video